Hello everyone, I'm Junyu from Palace. I would like to introduce our project eAuth. So what is eAuth? eAuth is an OAuth2 compatible authentication service. People can use it like using third-party logging services such as GitHub Login, Facebook Login, Google Login, or so on. But it is actually a first-party logging service. You can host your own authentication server by yourself. Moreover, this is innately integrated with Ethereum. Users can enjoy the Ethereum ecology at the same time. Now I will use this course as the example to show how it works. First, you need to sign up an account, but I will skip this. I log in with my username and my password. And you can see there's an option here called login with eAuth, but I will show you later. After I log in, I go to the settings page to connect my Ethereum wallet address with this Discourse account. You can see eAuth here. Click the connect and you can authenticate with your Ethereum wallet. Click the login and it will pop up a MetaMask window. If you use Brave browser or Miss browser, it also works. You can see this is your Ethereum address. So you authorize it and you can connect and bind this uh, Discourse account with your Ethereum wallet address. So from now on, you can um, log in with your Ethereum wallet address using eAuth. I will show this. Click the login with eAuth, and you can see your Ethereum wallet address, but you can use another account. You just need to yeah, log in again so you can switch your account. You can sign this um, signature request and authorize it. Now you successfully log in with eAuth. There's another cool function. If you use Safari and yeah, there's no Web3.js injected or there's no MetaMask uh, extension in Safari, I can also log in with a mobile app. You can click login with eAuth. And you can see that there's a, a QR code here, and you can use mobile wallet to log in. Now I open my iPhone, and this is I'm token uh, and wallet uh, app. I go to the browser and use the QR code reader here. And this is my MacBook. I use the QR code reader to scan the QR code on my computer. And you can see that it pop up a window on my phone so I can log in with my Ethereum wallet address on my phone with the same Ethereum address. Click the confirm. And you can see that I can authorize it on my computer. So I click the authorize. Now I successfully log in on Safari and there's no web 3 injected. Yeah, thank you for listening to this uh, introduction video of eAuth. Uh, if you have any question, don't hesitate to contact us. I will leave the, the contact email uh, below this video. Yeah, thank you very much again.